Tonight, deputies tell us some destructive thieves are behind bars. Investigators say these suspects have caused some serious damage to homes after they stole appliances and caused some massive flooding. Fox News' Doug Evans, live in Coweta County, where a sharp-eyed deputy is credited with ending this crime spree. Doug? Tom, imagine coming home and finding water pouring out of your front door. That's been the nightmare here in Coweta County for over a week now. Thieves stealing appliances that had been hooked up to water lines, just yanking them out and walking away with the water running. All of it brought to, end, brought to an end this week by a sharp-eyed Coweta County deputy. A Coweta County deputy on patrol passed this long driveway off Tope Road and spotted a small U-Haul truck backed up to the house. The home was for sale. Those two clues added up and led to the arrest of Mark Anthony Simon and Antoine Octavius Johnson. Investigators say the men were part of a ring, stealing appliances from homes. Among the items, dishwashers and refrigerators that had been hooked up to water lines and when ripped off, the water was just left running, ruining homes and costing thousands thousands of dollars in damage. The deputy reported that the men were in the process of removing appliances from that house on Tope Road and were loading them up in the U-Haul truck. Fox 5 News has obtained the arrest report from the Coweta County Sheriff's Office. The deputy wrote that he found in the back of the U-Haul a washer and dryer and gas stove. These items, he wrote, had been stolen in a burglary a few hours earlier. The report goes on to say that on the dash of the U-Haul was a list of addresses, and the first address on the list was a residence that had been burglarized earlier. Police found water pouring from that home's front door, a broken appliance water line. The report said in Investigators had put out a bolo, a be on the lookout for a small U-Haul seen at the burglaries. The report said the homes were either under construction or had a for sale sign in the yard. After further investigation, two more arrests, Marcus D'Angelo Nix and Misty Shakina Fife. Investigators say it was Fife who had rented the U-Haul. All four are being charged with burglary. Investigators say they'll also face additional charges for the extensive water damage done to the homes. Coweta County Sheriff Mike Yeager has high praise for his deputy that ended all of this saying he's glad to have this case wrapped up before Christmas. Now, one of the victims in this case, he was just days away from selling his house. The closing was just any day. He came home to find water pouring out of his house as well. Live in Coweta County, Doug Evans, Fox 5 News.